but this thing is really fighting the negative charge from, uh, and that's what I noticed about uh, Tesla's impulse technology, that once you charge the battery with that type of energy, you have a very difficult time trying to ever get a positive charge in it again. Tesla's one-wire system is very strange in that the energy is time. It's moving back and forth on the wire in time. And you can see here, Tony, we're down to three. What exactly do you mean? You say it's moving back in time. It's it's it, moving well, it waxes and wanes back and forth. Right. You know, it's an energy pump. You say the impulse technology makes the vacuum energy, I mean, it's at this time at one point, and then it's at this time, and this time, and this time, and this time, and it keeps going back and forth. But you're not, a, you're not messing with a time stream, per se. Well, you are messing with the time of the battery. Right. But not with the general time stream. I have seen, on one-wire systems, charging batteries, batteries completely lose the electrolyte and crystallize. I reported that on the SG group. And I stopped goofing around with that because no matter what gel cell I put on there, the next morning I come in and you could rattle it. You could rattle it like a maraca. <laughs> I had to throw out all the batteries because it seemed like it's sucking the energy out of the battery rather than putting it in, the energy in the battery. Where it's going, probably back into the vacuum. <laughs> but I mean, the battery does give an indication that it's charged negatively. And this is what I'm trying to show here. But you, you mentioned something with the pendulum, just digressing a little bit. That's a time charge. Now, what, do you, what exactly do you mean by a time charge? It, all the SG machines are time charged batteries. They work on a time charge. Okay, but yeah, it, impulse time charge. So okay, so it's so. not messing with a time stream. No, so, yeah. No. These holes. This is a battery plate. Right. And 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 when you somehow when you negatively charge this battery, you can't supply a positive energy to fill in these holes. It just keeps eating these electrons. Right. You see it? And then the only thing that's happening here is heat. So the best way to get out of this situation, to revert the battery back, is to get get the battery back is to deplete the energy out completely. And then of course this would be the normal solution with the ions. Okay? And then once you deplete all the energy out in that negative energy, after that's gone and the battery is depleted to zero, then you can potentialize the ions to move. To charge the battery, and 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 it won't be absorbed into these holes. Right. You follow me. Right. It yeah, won't, yeah. It won't get swallowed up. <clears throat> yeah. In these holes. So I wanted to add that. Right. No, that's good. <laughs>